who doesn't love an action movie packed with martial art moves? The icons of martial arts cinema are well known from the great Bruce Lee, Jackie Chan, to Jet Li and Tony Ja. So, today we are gonna look at the top martial arts stars and their best action-packed movies of all time. Before we jump onto the main video, please do subscribe to our channel if you're a movie freak and need movie suggestions. Number 8. Michael J. White. Michael J. White is proficient in a number of different martial arts styles and has showcased those skills in a number of films. Michael has been learning martial arts since childhood and holds a black belt in Shotokan Karate, Gojurayu, Kayakushin, Taekwondo, Kabuto, Wushu, and Tang Soo Do. He can be easily one of the deadliest actor to mess with. But luckily he seems to be a pretty nice guy. He has starred in a number of action movies, and the best movies of his career are Blood and Bone, which is a lots of intense action, plenty of killings, and brutal bare-knuckled fighting in the slums. Undisputed 2. This movie is about Michael being framed for possessing drugs and then to a Russian prison where he realizes that boxing against inmate Yuri Boyka is the only way out. This movie's fight choreography is easily one of the best in the world. Never back down. This movie was excellent and related to physical fitness and inner core exercises. Action combat movie lovers should definitely watch this movie. Number 7. Jean-Claude Van Damme. Van Damme is bringing great martial arts movies for over 30 years. His father introduced him to martial arts when he saw his son was physically weak, and now. He has a second-degree black belt in Shotokan Karate. He competed in a number of karate and kickboxing tournaments before launching his acting career. He has also studied Taekwondo and Muay Thai. Van Damme's breakout film was Bloodsport, an American soldier who is skilled in the ways of the ninjutsu, leaves the army life behind to participate in a secret martial arts tournament. Some of his best action movies are. Kickboxer. This movie is enjoyable, as you can feel the momentum, rage and energy Van Damme brings out when a fight scene occurs. Kickboxer and Bloodsport is easily the best movies of Van Damme. Number 6. Scott Adkins. Scott Adkins is an English actor, producer, screenwriter, gymnast, and martial artist, mostly known for his roles in direct-to-video action films. He is well known for his role as Boyka. Scott Adkins has 10 black belts in martial arts. He also runs his own YouTube channel, teaching various types of martial art moves and techniques to his fan followers. He is easily one of the underrated action star in the Hollywood industry. Some of his best movies are Undisputed. This movie where Scott Adkins plays has Boyka, keeps you on the edge of the seat. If you are a UFC fan, then this is your movie, which is filled with hardcore fights and bone-shattering, blood-splatting fights. You will find yourself white-knuckled or screaming at the TV as if it was a live pay-per-view event. Hard Target 2. This movie has action scene from the beginning to the end of the movie where Scott Adkins struggles to survive in Myanmar against a group of hitmen who wants to kill him. Ninja. This movie has a fantastic story. And the screenplay, action scenes, and fight sequences are mind-blowing, Scott Adkins in his usual excellence. This is one of the best classical film ever made. Number 5. Vidyut Jamwal. Vidyut Jamwal is an Indian film actor and stunt performer who is well known for his roles in action films like Commando series. He is a trained martial artist, who studied the art of Kalari since the age of three, which is an Indian martial art that originated in modern-day Kerala. Vidyut kicked off an initiative to teach self-defense techniques to college girls and working professionals. And he also owns his own YouTube channel, teaching Kalari and interviewing top MMA stars all around the world. His movie Commando was a big hit and put him at the top in the Indian film industry. This movie is about an Indian commando where the Chinese government incarcerates him, accusing him of being an Indian spy after he survives a plane crash in their territory and then finds a way to escape the enemy camp. Due to its success at the box office, the team continues to film Commando 2 and then 3 and which now became a fan's favorite movie franchise. Number 4. Tony Ja. Muay Thai is famous today, which is popular among the MMA fighters. But the art of eight limbs was considerably less well known when Tony Jaa burst onto the scene in 2003 with Ong Bak the Thai warrior. 
he was internationally recognized for his fighting styles in the Ong Bak series. Tony Jaa was inspired to learn martial arts after watching the icons Bruce Lee, Jackie Chan, and Jet Li on screen. Ong Bak 1 and 2 are one of his best movies. This movie states how the actual stunts must be depicted on movies so that realistic fight can be enjoyed. This movie is about an ancient Buddha statue's head, sacred to a village, is stolen. Tony Jaa volunteers to bring it back. For this, he must defeat the enemies on his way and retrieve it back. This movie is a must-watch where even someone who doesn't have much interest in martial arts will also fall in love with martial arts. Number 3. Donnie Yen. Donnie Yen is a Hong Kong Chinese actor who is an exceptionally gifted martial artist, proficient in a number of different styles. Yen entered the cinema industry as a stuntman and then started to direct his own movies, starring himself as the lead role. Yen is consistently one of the highest paid actors in Asia. He became very popular around the world after his role as Wing Chun Grandmaster in the movie IP Man. Some of his best action movies are The Iron Monkey. This movie is action-packed, with Ping's trademark unique fighting sequences. Whether it's bodies slamming through tables or hopping from roof to rooftop, there's so much action in this movie. Donnie Yen's martial arts was very impressive and his character was very straight to the point. Flashpoint. Donnie Yen once again proved why he is the best Asian on-screen fighter still to this day. This movie is easily one of the best movies in his career. This movie also did a fantastic job of conveying a theme of rage and intolerance. The movie is about an impulsive inspector risks the lives of an undercover police officer and his girlfriend as he tries to take on a small but powerful Vietnamese Chinese gang. This movie is definitely worth the watch. Number 2. Jackie Chan. Who doesn't love him? He is a badass and famous for doing all his stunts by himself in his movies and breaking countless bones. He is one of the most genuinely likable and humble actors around the world. While other action stars are known for their scowls and simmering rage, Jackie Chan's best characters always seem to be having fun, and that fun is contagious. Chan was already a seasoned martial artist when he too began work as a stuntman in the 70s. He became an inspiration to all other action stars. Films like Drunken Master, The Big Brawl, and Police Story made him famous around the world, and then he continued his career in Hollywood movies like Rush Hour, Shanghai Noon, and The Forbidden Kingdom, which got him lots of love in Hollywood too. Number 1. Bruce Lee. Of course, who else can take the number one spot? Bruce Lee will forever be the greatest icon of martial arts cinema. Even though his life was cut tragically short at the age of 32, Bruce Lee had already accomplished more than ever other people can do in a century. He mastered kung fu and developed his own martial arts style and wrote several books, and he also trained Westerners in the Chinese martial arts and became the biggest movie star in the world. Films like The Big Boss, Fist of Fury, Way of the Dragon, Enter the Dragon, and Game of Death are still called as the best action movies, even 50 years after his death. Empty your mind. Be formless, shapeless, like water. Now you put water into a cup, it becomes the cup. You put water into a bottle, it becomes the bottle. You put in a teapot, it becomes the teapot. Now water can flow or it can crash. Be water, my friend. That's all for today guys, hope you liked this video. Support our video by giving us a thumbs up, until that, see you in another video, cheers.